before I start the video, I just want to say shout out to Super Silent Mikey because he was almost at 1k subscribers. Anyway, let's get to the video. What's up, bro? Since I'm Dixon, I'm sorry, I'm too. The Loud House is going. Is going live action 2020 movie explained. What? This is kind of shocking, guys, because we always seen the lot like the lot of animation. Like, okay, like for me, honestly, if the cartoon's going live action, I'm fine. I just want to know, is it going to work? Because, I mean, for Spongebob, I mean, it, it worked. We still watched it. I mean, for other cartoons, it, I mean, it still worked. So, I mean, will it work for the Loud, how, Loud House? Depends on who's, like, playing the characters. Unless it's actually not, you know, they're not going, they're not, you know, going live action. <laughs> you know, them going live action might have different ideas. But let's, let's just see. Let's just see. So, guys, don't forget to like that. Let's go. I'm just going to five on my Let's go to the video. Three, two, one, my Mm. Nickelodeon's Upfront is here, and that means some interesting pieces of info about upcoming cartoons. Mm -hmm. In terms of animation, Loud House. let's start with what I mentioned in the title of the video. The Loud House is going live action. I now, can't believe it. The entire cartoon is going for some, pe for some reason, some people stop watching Loud House. No, I still no, watch it. Probably go down in flames. What I mean is that Lincoln Loud and the rest of his family will be live action, not on the TV show, but in the form of a movie. More specifically, Wait, what? this will be some kind of adventure wow. happening in the fourth quarter of the year, like around the it. holidays. Its title is The Loud House, A Very Loud Christmas. Can we please take a step back? Oh, and it's, a, it's, it's gonna be a Christmas like special. It's hard to take animated properties and bring them into the real world, okay. capturing everything that made them so amazing in the first place. With the brand new Loud House movie coming to Nick, I can't help hmm. but think about what went down with the Furly Eye parents. It was a well-known name, and Drake Bell okay, so... Like Turner. Sadly, these movies don't have the best reputation, even though I'm gonna throw it, a hot It doesn't, but say, I mean, I, I, I watched the Fair Appearance movies and they weren't the best, but I liked them. Yeah, yeah, whatever. But either way, the magic of Fairly Odd Parents, pun very much intended, wasn't accurately shown in the real world. Animation is special because it doesn't follow many rules, but things can be ruined in live action. Yeah, it, it can, guys, it can. Like, like a SpongeBob in live action, that's totally different. Fairly Odd Parents, and it, it did that, but. You know, like, not the entire show. For me, I, I hate it considering, you know, even though it wasn't funny or anything, it was still enjoyable. Also, it's very odd parents, of course. It's just that it wasn't really, like, the best theater. So, I mean, I enjoyed it. Like, just saying, it wasn't the best. So if you were a fan of these kinds of movies, then who knows? There's a decent chance you'll find some enjoyment in the Loud House live action. I might watch least, it, and I might enjoy it. It's just, de reality, it's just depends. So it depends. should be easy to replicate in real life, even if it isn't anywhere near as charming as a cartoon. Lincoln Loud coming to our world wasn't the only news from Nick's upfront, though, because there was oh. a brief tidbit about SpongeBob's prequel series. Uh -oh. And so now, we've simply hmm. been calling it Camp Coral, but the new official name is Camp, Camp Coral, Coral SpongeBob's Under, Under Years. years. And it's a 13 episode project the new time i'm gonna keep calling long, it camp so, uh, coral i'm just gonna keep calling it camp coral. it's a thank you very much you know it's about him and his friends being at camp so oh, i mean yeah, calling camp coral coral makes sense to see bikini bottoms camp adventures this july also mentioned in the networks up front is big nate he's getting a 26 episode animated series airing on nick so oh, that's kind of cool to see i don't have anything hmm. more to say but cool to see but what are your thoughts on all this nickelodeon news let's talk Never heard comments. of Big Nate. Hmm, might have to search that up later. But I actually never heard of Big Nate. Hmm. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys mm. next time. Mm. Mm. So, yes, that's it. Okay, so, wow. So, live. So, Link. So the Loud House is going live action. SpongeBob, the spin, the, the SpongeBob spinoff um, has a new name now, Camp Coral. 
um, Sp SpongeBob's underwears, which I'm just gonna keep calling Camp Croyle, Crawl, because why not? Camp Croyle, Crawl, Crawl, whatever. And we also start getting another show, um, another animation show, Big Nate, which I've never heard about it, but from the way Vioski on ninety four said it, it sounds like the, that's either a name that's been around for a while or a long time. I'm not really sure. So I have to switch it up and see. So my thoughts mm, depends because, I mean, maybe it could be good. Maybe. I'm not really a fan of Nickelodeon live action movies. I mean, yes, I watch Fred, Fred 2 and Fred 3, but I mean, those were bad movies, even though I, I like, even though for some reason I still watch them, even though they're bad movies. So. Um, what else? I, I like the fair appearance going. I mean, I liked it, but I didn't like the movies. But the movies were still enjoyable. Man, man, that's pretty much it. So, me, my thoughts is, it depends on, you know, who's actually going to like, pl be playing, like, all the characters. Like, who's going to be playing Lincoln, his sisters, his mom, Rita, or, you know... Who's gonna be playing, you know, Len, not Len Jr., you know, Len Sr., or whatever. And it was gonna be playing, like, Clyde, and, like, all of them. Like, who's gonna be playing, like, all the main characters? That's the only thing that I'm worrying about. And, yeah. So, might be a good movie, maybe not. For me, right now, it depends on who's, like, playing the characters and what's the plot gonna be. But, yeah. So, yeah, that's about it. Please don't subscribe. And if you're subscribed, I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.